11, a Roswell family's dog shot and killed. And tonight, police tell us the alleged shooter will not face any charges. This happened after a maintenance worker entered an apartment to do some repair work. He says he had no choice. The family says he wasn't even supposed to be there. CBS 46's Sierra Cummings live in Roswell with more details on what happened. What a terrible story, Sierra. It is. This is Enclave Apartments. The eight month old German Shepherd was shot and killed here Monday. Police say their investigation points to self defense. The family argues why did a maintenance worker have a gun responding to maintenance calls in the first place? She was eight months. She was raised with kids. And everybody knows when a dog is raised with kids, they're friendly. Luna and her family moved to Enclave Apartments just one month ago. Big but gentle, says her owner, Jordania Mejia. She was a puppy. A Roswell police report describes the opposite on May 2nd. A maintenance worker told officers he asked for the dog to be secured by the grandmother, but that it chased the grandmother, then chased him down the stairs. The 33-year-old worker alleged in fear for his safety, he used his 9mm handgun to shoot. He was doing self-defense. He had no bitten. He wasn't scratched. His his clothes wasn't torn apart. Mejia argues she should have gotten a heads up about when the maintenance worker would service her home. That way she could be there. They have somebody walking around with a gun that shot my dog twice and he left her there to die. Her children are scarred. Her family devastated, maintaining Luna was just playful, not dangerous. You could go around and ask anybody in that neighborhood that have seen her for a month that I've been there how she is. And we did. You knew the dog? Was it, did you, was it ever aggressive? Is it aggressive? No. No? Was, did you ever see him be aggressive or anything like that? No. Tenants claim the worker has since been fired, but property management neither confirmed to us his employment status nor its policies on entering units armed. She said that she was very sorry that they had fired him. If he was right on killing my dog, why did they fire him? That's what I don't understand. We asked property management several questions. They told us they could not answer and to reach out to their corporate, which is First Communities. We reached out to First Communities and we're still waiting on an official statement. We've also made multiple attempts to reach that worker. We have not yet heard back. Live in Roswell, I'm Sierra Cummings, CBS 46 News.